Hey everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Ratchet and Clank, up your arsenal. Last time we did Annihilation Nation, uh, we've also done Dax and Tyrannosis and Aquados and Marcadia and stuff recently. This time we're going to go to the Hollow Star Studios rather than Obani Gemini, because I don't really like Obani Gemini and I like Hollow Star Studios relatively. So let's go. I think that we get my favorite weapon here. So that is another incentive. For sure. Which means um, we'll go back to Annihilation Nation sometime, and uh, that'll have, after that weapon challenge that we couldn't do with the disc blade gun, uh, there's going to be another one. At least one other one. I believe. And, uh, yeah, that'll be with my favorite weapon. Which will be awesome! Jeeves, activate the cloaking device. With pleasure, sir. Now you see us, now you... Oh, crud. Cut, cut, that's it! You've disgraced my set for the last time, kid. Take up basket weaving, you're fired! Get me the monkey. I'll see you at the trailer, Clank. Agent Clank, meet your new sidekick. All right, forget the chase scene and go right to the grand finale. You did read the script I sent you. Uh, uh, first, you narrowly survive a series of death-defying stunts, yada yada. You defeat the terror of Talos, yada yada yada. Finally, you rescue the Baroness, played by the lovely Miss Courtney Gears. Okay. And action! So the only negative here. Will you take out the henchman, then chase Maximilian out of the bar? Try to make it look real, all right? Action! All right. The only negative here is that unfortunately we have to start the level with a clank level. Other than that, this place is great. All right. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna be in interrupting him unintentionally, but anyway, I gotta wreck up the bar. I die here every so often. Okay, Clank here in other places. On his tail. Max Million tries to shake him off in rush hour traffic. All right, I love a good chase scene. Okay. Uh, now I could or could not, but will spend right, time gambling a bunch. Great, kid. Now avoid the lasers and meet up with the monkey in the casino parking lot. Some of them blow up. Anyway, the goal is to get a jackpot because there's another skill point for that. And yeah, it costs us a little bit of money, but we're going to profit in general. And I'm going to end up maybe dying. Because I'm an idiot. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's things like this that I don't necessarily like. That killed me. Okay. One more time, people, like we rehearsed it, and action! Okay, that was really stupid, and I guess I'm just gonna skip it because I don't care that much. Now get to Max Million's office before he can make his escape. I I don't know how many skill points do we have. Okay, what I'm looking at is cheats. We have big head heroes. We have it doesn't say seven. So yeah, I don't care enough. Never mind. We'll just try and rush through this. Collect all these bolts. Do we really have that much money? Oh yeah, we hey, just did the um Portastic battle. All right, I, I love, love a good JC. All right, so we're just gonna do this normally. Be on our way. I'm not wearing a tuxedo. Am I supposed to be? Great, I don't know if it skins now, me for me. Oh, I gotta rescue this monkey now. See, I kind of forget what happens in the Clank levels because Agent Clank and the monkey must put aside their differences and work together to reach that ledge. Let's see some real emotion out there, okay? Anyway, because I hate them. All right, now go there. Actually, get on. All right, help me out. All right, you just make sure you're, yeah. So we get our normal companions from the other games and go on our way. Do the normal Clank stuff, shooting them banana. 
Good job being an idiot, monkey. Alright, I gotta have these dudes wait, because otherwise they'll kill themselves repeatedly. There's our bridge. Excellent. Now, can you follow from there? Yes, you can. And now we just wait a little bit and then tell them to enter. Kill some dudes as usual. Doesn't matter how many times you punch the monkey, you can punch the monkey all day if you want. And that's that. Okay, this is it, people. The grand finale, Giant Clank versus the Terror of Talos. Don't screw this up, kid. Action! Alright, so shoot those with circle. Throw a bomb with triangle. That's it. And we just gotta kill this boss dude. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, you note that unlike the previous game, the the triangle bomb is a rechargeable thing rather than uh, an ammo thing. As are our missiles. Okay, so we've got to kill a bunch of these ninjas. As you can see in the bottom, the count is five. Come on, why are you looking that way? Uh, anyway, my health is kind of low. And uh, the helicopters are just kind of there for fun. Uh, this has gone slower in the past, but also faster in the past, so, you know, I won't say I'm doing great, I won't say I'm doing terribly. I've died more than once, as opposed to just once. Alright, where is the terror of what's-his-name? Oh, there are six more ninjas, of course. Well, where are they? I don't know if there's a skill point for destroying, like, all of the buildings on the set. There probably is. You know, let's just be honest with ourselves. Oh, there, there's one. Good, good. Guess I may as well use bombs on him. Good job floating. I appreciate your ability to float. And my ability to just, like, walk on you. Where are the rest of my ninja bros? There's one. Thank you for dying. There's the other one. Oh, good, there are tanks. Alright, now we can kill the terror again. When we jumped into the set, which is kind of funny. Come on, back to that. Ah, stop doing what you're doing, man. Where'd you go? You can only throw the thingy while you're standing on the ground. By the way. That's it, Clay! Kick some <laughs> Alright. Good that hit. See you never know how the homing is on some stuff. We're almost done. Oh, come on. Garbage. Why are the helicopters not on his on my side anyway? Good. Check the gate. Oh good, we won. Alright, now nothing wants to kill us. It's funny that they just hire like the thugs for less dudes to kill us. All in a day's work. Cut! Print it! That's a wrap, people! Pure box office raritanium clank. Even the critics are gonna love it. You have no idea what a thrill it is to be rescued by a big hunk of titanium alloy like yourself. <laughs> Perhaps now you will tell me what Dr. Nefarious is planning. I have a better idea. Why don't you ask him yourself? I have a present for you, Snooky Wookums. Ah, I told you to stop calling me that! Just bring me Agent Clank! Of course, darling. Where am I? Is someone there? I seem to... Yes, Clank, it is an honor to finally make your acquaintance. I have been following your exploits ever since your first mission. When you defeated the mind-stealing snot beasts from Dimension X. I believe there has been a misunderstanding. Secret Agent Clang is merely a fictional character I play on the horror video. Squishy lies. Oh, Lance. I can't. It's not right. 
You're my cousin's uncle's son. Nice. You are a hero to robots across the galaxy. And yet, you deny your own destiny. You choose to bow and scrape before the squishies. Where is your pride in who you are, Agent Clank? Organic life forms have as much right to inhabit this galaxy as we do. I see no reason to exclude them. I will give you a reason. Join me, and together we will rule an entire galaxy of robots. Or refuse. Remain a traitor to your own kind, and follow your beloved squishies into the black hole of oblivion! Interesting argument he poses. Sorry, we're waiting on a short cutscene, I believe. Clink should have been back by now. What could be taking him so long? Okay, so now we got some monsters to fight. Alright, let's upgrade these dudes. This is a great place to get some stuff upgraded if you just haven't done it yet, because enemies like those are incredibly powerful and thus worth a ton of experience. So there, that upgraded to V3. Didn't go significantly further, but, you know, they exist now. Max out our ammo. Oh look, the Rift Inducer! I wonder what this could do. Uh, we're definitely going to edit our Quick Select. I don't know where this goes on my Quick Select. I have a standard order as I've explained before. But you know what? This goes somewhere instead of nowhere. Let's just go with that. Uh, for now, let's just put it there. So what the Rift Inducer does is, uh, basically it's awesome. That's what it does. No, it's, uh, it pops open a black hole kind of dealio that sucks up enemies. And, yeah. Upgrades into something equally awesome. You can also shoot multiple rifts into one place, and it'll suck up enemies more quickly or more powerful enemies possible. Basically, it's just the best. It is like my favorite thing in the freaking game. It is my favorite thing. It's one of my favorite items in the whole series. So, uh, I'm, I'm real glad that we get it here, as I thought we did. And with the time, we seem to get a lot of bolts for this which is totally cool with me. And it's already up to V2, which is amazing. Uh, I'm going to get to V5 incredibly quickly, if you're wondering at all, which you probably aren't. It also breaks boxes for us. What more could you ask for? This thing is perfect. And we had plenty of money for it. All right, we got to hack something here. NBD, man. Let's see what we can get going. All right. Oh, I'm using the wrong keys. Sorry, I haven't played in like a week. But I'll get it down. This is four freaking... Wow. Oops. Okay, that was that's done. I'm not in the groove of this quite now. Uh, that's how we can do it. We just gotta get into it and then everything... God. Very not into it. Clearly by the fact that I missed there. Get out of the way. But wow, four layers, stages, whatever you want to call it. At least they're relatively quick. We only need 10. Sometimes you need like 15, 20. I'm sure there are challenge ones that you need like 20 or something. Or just later it gets to be more, but seemingly rather than... Wow, that was easy. Rather than add more things to collect, they just add more layers. Well, you know, whatever works. Uh, well handled. And now we get an elevator. Great. Rift Inducer is to be two. Let's just uh, make sure everyone gets sucked up by it. Like, I don't even care about using my ammo relatively poorly, because I just get more. Uh, now here is an easy titanium bolt. 
I'm yeah, I'm just here assuming that that guy got sucked up, and of course he did. Now I could spend some time playing these. I'll just play them all once. Well, I guess I'll play some of them twice. All right, I'm just gonna quit with that. We still don't have the box breaker, but that's relatively soon, I promise. Box breaker's a great time. Oh, good, another four stage. Well. That was stupid. Oh my god. I really do hate the hacker. It's just, as I've said, it's poorly designed for engaging play. And that's really easy sometimes. And I just, I don't even have good things to say over it. It's just like, boring and commentary killing. But it gets done. Oh, who knew? Oh yeah, another way they make it more difficult is by having the shields take the red ones like all the way to the top, so you have to be waiting for them. And again, it's just poor design. Yeah, there we go. It's just not responding when I want it to either, is what's happening. Okay, at least we're done. Rift Inducer? <laughs> See, it just clears the way nice and nice. I'm not gonna kill this and oh it is gonna kill. I thought this was uh, the next gap. Wow, it killed them really fast. I used two and I didn't even need to. Hey, get out of my face. Good. I'm not gonna kill this dude, so we're actually gonna use the annihilator, I guess. Which killed it in two hits. Oh, that was close. Though it did use my ammo when I didn't want it to. Get sucked into this, dudes. Thanks. <laughs> Just look how great it is. Why did that only shoot forward no distance? I guess it can't shoot when you're jumping too well. Though that seems weird. That should get all three of them. Might even upgrade for it. No, but we'll get more ammo. You know, as if on cue. Yeah, there's uh, an Inferno crate there, but I don't need that. I don't need your tricks. Two Annihilator ammo is not what I was after. Uh, this place has a cool thing where you flip the switch and it starts snowing. Or you flip it again and it starts raining again. Uh, I guess we'll use these dudes. Who now shoot faster and do more damage and stuff? Maximum nanotech increased. Sure. I guess I'll use more of them. What are you doing, you idiots? Whatever. That's not what I asked for. Okay, so this is gonna get us back to our ship. Frank, where have you been? I thought something happened to you. I was having my sprockets lubed. You picked a fine time for a tune-up. Where's Courtney Gears? Miss Gears has left the planet. What? Well, what about Nefarious? Did she tell you where he is? Dr. Nefarious is aboard a star cruiser called the Leviathan. Um, okay. Nice job, Clank. So, I'll just call Sasha and have her track down that star cruiser. <laughs> I was gonna say, man, Clank's acting weird, isn't he? But I guess we know that now. So, uh, we can teleport all the way back and uh, just go through that whole run through again. Whoa, that was weird. Oh, okay, camera's just not enjoying itself. Okay, calm down. Oh my god. Enter the ship. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had that happen before. Next time we're gonna go to a Bonnie Gemini. And uh, that's gonna do it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.